Doctor, Mrs. Lester ist hier. Sehr gut. Schau her in. Good morning, Dr. Ehrlich. Well, after that first night, I told you about it last time, my life has completely changed. I feel I'm the victim of sexual obsession and incipient nymphomania. I don't know what else to call it. Anyway, we've been married, let's see, last Thursday was six weeks, and really, I just don't know how to cope with all this. I've been in a constant state of sexual frenzy ever since that first time. It's something that seems to grab hold of me. It makes me do things I never would have dreamed of before. The impulse is so terribly powerful. That's why I've come to you. I'm really a very lucky woman, Doctor. Victor is so understanding and so intelligent. He's the one who suggested I come to you. We both hope you can help me. I'll certainly do everything within my power, madam. Now, have there been any other manifestations of what we might call your sexual proclivities? <laughs> well, if you count practically raping a cute young girl in a health club, I guess so. Could we have some details? All right. Victor and I both like to keep in form and work out. At this point, Laura, I think we ought to take advantage of a very useful tool in psychiatry. We'll try hypnotic regression as of our next appointment. We'll explore your subconscious and go back into your past in our search to find out why you have this excessive sexuality. Now stretch out. Just relax. We're going back into your past. All you can hear now is my voice. Look at the light coming at you and see it from behind your closed eyes. That's fine. You feel good. All you can hear is my voice. We're going back into your past. Laura, you're 17. Your body is that of a mature woman, but you don't know it. I'm in the shower. Yes, caressing my tits. Now, my dear, tell me who you are, what you see in front of you, when and where you are. My name is Rowena. I live in a very small town. It's the beginning of springtime. The year is 1887. At a young age, I was given a husband, Doctor. A man whose warmth is totally lacking. We make love once a month, no more. It was really extraordinary. I'd never realized that you know, uh, it could be good with a husband. Yes, yes, I must try it again as soon as it can be arranged. Tell me something. Who were you most recently, before you became Laura? I... My name is Magnus the Magnificent. World famous, renowned master of magic. In every country I arouse enthusiasm. I am currently showing in Paris. This is the final phase of your treatment, Laura. You are under deep hypnosis. I want you to relive the best sexual moment you ever had with Victor. Think now. You love your husband, don't you? You're at home, just the two of you, and you want him very much. Ah, oh, Victor, mon amour. Take a look. I had you in mind when I bought this. I hope I got my son.